Hello everyone, my name is Chris. I'm here to help you with the rescue fare from the Einher Jar quest during Creatures of Prophecy. That's enough. Once you see the signal, it won't be it too confusing, it's just mostly... There's an enemy that kind of hides, which is annoying, so I'll show you where to find him, and then you just gotta use the, the new item you got to change it from day and night. So once you get in this boat, you just gotta go right. There's a celestial altar across the river. According to Big Fear, the altars were once used to signal the wolves, and now we have just the scepter to do it. What is your plan? When we reach the temple, I'll fire off the beacon. A signal for Vela and Birger to set off their distraction. The Dark Elf Hive. Nice to not be on the receiving end of it for once. <laughs> They've rallied more soldiers since our last visit. Hmm. Our disadvantages are many. All right, so this is the part with the hidden enemy. He's actually up here in the top left. You can use your cast plates to burn these branches. Otherwise, these guys are just not gonna die. Yeah, you can see the like that trail. So try and follow that once he gets out of there, and then you can kill everything else. Try dragging the scepter across the bell a few times. of the giants. Atreus believes Ragnarok is inevitable. The Norns were quite clear on the nature of prophecy. They told us that some of our choices were predictable. But we have changed, haven't we? Perhaps. <laughs> The Norn said you'd kill Heimdall, but you chose not to walk that path. Back when we first met, I doubt you'd have done the same. And you? Do you still seek Ragnarok? 
Odin has much to answer for. If Groa's prophecy is correct, so as for here, we want to do what we did with Atreus and Helheim. We want to draw the axe at one, use the red arrows to freeze one, and then use our axe on the second one. What? The most annoying man alive. More up ahead. On your mark. I don't doubt it. Curious, though. What was she doing here? Odin used roots of the World Tree as part of his spell that kept me from leaving Midgard. Neathhope protects the tree's roots, wherever they are. Ah, I see. Odin used her. And she unwittingly paid the price. Classic Odin. Just make extra noise once the assault begins. If we distract them long enough, Hildesfini and Atreus will have more than enough time to get in and out undetected. I am not worried for Atreus. He is ready to fight on his own. This is it. There's an altar behind these vines. <laughs> Call on Skull, please. Are you ready? I am. Are you? I'm not leaving here without my brother. 